Hey, what's up YouTube? How's it going? It's me, Tobias here. Thank you for joining me today. If you haven't done so yet, make sure you go down there and hit that subscribe button. Um, today, I have another microphone review video for you guys. This is it right here inside this box. If you look on the side, there's a picture of the microphone. That's what the microphone looks like. Um, and yeah, it looks like this is the brand right here. I don't know how you say that. Baizewoo? Baizewoo? I don't know. Um, what does this thing say? It says made in China. This right here is the Amazon page. Um, I am going to link this down in the description below in case any of you guys are interested in checking this microphone out. But right here on the Amazon page, you know, it says that it's a condenser mic and um, it works on PC or Mac. So anyways, guys, as usual, I'm going to do a quick unboxing followed by a demo and then my review of the microphone. All right guys, so this is what we're looking at right here. Um, yeah, it just came with the microphone and the instructions. Pretty simple. Um, this foamy thing, you know, it, it did get a little dented it looked like, probably in the shipping. But that shouldn't be such a big deal. If you look underneath, the actual mic part is, you know, undamaged. <laughs> If you look underneath this stand, um, it does have these little rubber feet to prevent it from slipping around. And over here we got Rico. Hey Rico. There's also a little uh, light here on the front of the base. Um, it's probably like an, and a button. It's probably like an on and off button. So let's go ahead and plug this thing in and test it out. All right guys, so right now you're, the audio that you're hearing is through this microphone. Um, I'm listening to it through the headphones so I can hear exactly what it sounds like. And right off the bat, I hear a lot of like um, interference. Like it sounds like there's a lot of interference. Like, like I'm sure you guys could hear that as well. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and assume that's a grounding issue with the microphone. <laughs> That's, uh, not the, yeah, there's definitely some sort of grounding issue with this microphone. Like, I wouldn't really be able to use audio from this for a project just because of the amount of uh, interference I'm hearing. And the reason I, I'm pretty sure it's a grounding issue, if you watch this right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to touch my laptop and you're going to hear the sound change. It got a little quieter when I touched my laptop. And I have a lamp right here. And just watch when I touch the lamp. Did you hear that? Like, s something is interfering with the microphone. I've messed around with a couple different things. I don't know what it is. Sometimes even just lights, like, um, can interfere with how a microphone sounds, especially fluorescent lights. And for that reason, I never record these videos. I have big fluorescent lights up here, and when I'm doing a microphone review, I never have them on because it's very common to have fluorescent microphones that interfere, sorry, fluorescent lamps or lights that interfere with microphones. Um, and right now I don't have any on, so I don't know where that interference is coming from. But I do like the idea of the microphone. You know, you can move this around. Um, yeah, that's honestly, um, that kind of interference kind of does it for me. That kind of, I'm going to check out. Yeah, like there's a lot of interference coming from something. I don't know. I'm sure you guys can hear that and I'm not doing anything like, just more interference or static kind of just keeps coming in and I don't know what that's from. But uh, this microphone goes for $16 um, and it's free shipping. Um, yeah, it is kind of... 
It seems like when I move my mouse, that also interferes. Let me turn off my mouse. I turned my mouse off. I still hear the interference, so I guess it's not the mouse. Um, but yeah, that's something that needs to be fixed, I guess. I think we've probably heard enough. Let me know what you guys think. Like, if it wasn't for that background noise, like that, that issue with the background noise, or the interference, I should say, I would actually like, like, I like this, I like how this mic is. It's very simple. It's pretty much plug it in your computer and use it. You don't have to have it close to you. You could have it like this far away. That's, that's totally doable. Um, and if you get closer, yeah, like, if it wasn't for that issue with the interference, I would totally recommend this microphone. I think that there's just too much interference to where it, the audio that you would get from this is actually usable. So yeah, let's go ahead and I'm going to switch back to the microphone on my camera. Alright guys, so now you're listening to me again on my um, microphone on my camera. And I just want to say, like, it was a little disappointing. Like, I was hoping that this microphone, because I was thinking to myself, I was like, wow, $15.99 for a USB condenser microphone for like you know not maybe not using to record music but you know just doing like voiceovers or you know anything anything like that I thought you know this would be a pretty good microphone um, but it was kind of unfortunate that it did have that whatever that was that grounding issue that issue with the interference if they're able if BZ Wow or however you pronounce that if they are able to um, fix that issue with the microphone so that there's none of that interference or static that you hear in the background i would totally recommend this but right now i i think it's just not there yet they just need to fix that issue um that's a pretty important thing that needs to be fixed with this microphone but if it but i mean the quality of how i thought my voice sounded through the headphones i thought was pretty good um so if they were able to figure out what that issue was and re-release this microphone for the same price and everything, I think it would be a really good deal. But just for right now, um, I probably wouldn't recommend it right now. All right, guys, so I just went onto the Amazon page to read some reviews to see if anyone else experienced a similar problem like I did. And I did find like one guy that said he experienced a buzzing noise um, from the microphone. So I don't know, um, that was the only one. I only saw one guy that had this issue. Um, maybe it's just this microphone, my particular microphone that I got. Maybe the other microphones are fine. I really don't know. But anyways, guys, if any of you guys happen to own this microphone, I'm really curious to know whether you guys experienced any interference when using this microphone. Anyways, guys, that's going to be just about it for this review. Um, thank you for watching. If you're new here, my name is Tobias. I do all sorts of kinds of videos. I do uh, review videos, cover songs, vlogs, uh, fish videos, pool pond videos, terrarium videos. I do like a lot of different stuff. And if you're interested, go ahead and check out my channel. And if you like what you see there, hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, give me a like. That helps me out a lot. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.